Hi, my name is Anthony Barron-Kirk. Just provide a quick summary of the exercises, foam rolls, and stretches that were covered today. Simple format of what you can think about doing on your own to build your own program. So first thing we covered was the foam roll. Think about doing these in all the foam roll spots for one to five minutes per, per tension spot, per hot spot. So this will be anywhere from 15 to 20 minutes will take for your foam rolling. Secondly, you will do the stretches. Ideally, in a corrective exercise format, we want to do two to three sets of each stretch. So for instance, the kneeling hip flexor stretch, where I use this foam object right here, we would do two to three on the left leg, two to three on the right leg, holding each for 30 to 60 seconds. Then we went to the calf stretch. The calf stretch, again, same thing. Two to three sets on the left, two to three sets on the right. So we have deactivated with the foam rolling. We have lengthened those same tissues with the stretching. And then we work to integrate. So for the corrective exercises, first we did tube walking. Again, simple tube. Think about doing two to three sets, really going for about 20 repetitions in both directions, or until you feel a good burn in through that area of the glute. So go for either 20 repetitions both ways, which would be 40. That would be one set, or just as many steps it takes for you to reach a good sensation through those gluteal muscles. Two to three sets. Second, we did the hip bridge on the fitness ball. Think about doing about 15 repetitions, very slow pace, a breath pace. Would it be about two, two, two? So inhaling on the way down, pausing at the bottom, inhale on the way up, pausing at the top. We're going to do two to three sets of these, 15 repetitions each. Last was the single leg squat on some bench. Do 15 repetitions on each side, left and right. I'm going to do two to three sets of these as well, really focusing on that knee tracking. This is a great basic overview of a knee progression. I would recommend doing this exercise program two to three times a week.